Hi, everybody. Hi, everyone. Rose here. So, uh, this is uh, today's topic. Uh, you know, hating is easy, but putting in the work is not. It's very easy to sit behind your, um, your typer or your phone to hate on others who are doing better than you. But putting in the work is something you cannot do. But you like to hate. You like to hate because it's easy. You know, you turn into a superwoman or superman. You know, um, you, you hate people who are doing better than you. You, you. you don't understand why they're successful. You don't want to study their lifestyle. You don't want to study what made them successful. But you are hating on their success. You are hating on the rich men. It's like most poor people like to hate on rich people. Oh, those rich people, they blame the rich. You are hating them. Why don't you study their lifestyle? I want to study their lifestyle. I want to become rich. I don't hate them. I want them to show me what they're doing that I'm not doing. What is keeping them in the one percentile? It's not hating. Try to figure out why they're in the one percentile. And how are you going to get there if you want to hate their lifestyle instead of hating on them? Because believe me, they are not the root of uh, all your problems. They're not even the root of any of your problems. No kidding. I mean it. Lawmakers, mm, I don't know about that part. But I'm talking about, you know, filthy rich people, people who are rich. They're not even thinking about you. That's how rich they are in their mindset. I'm not talking about monetary, but their mindset is always at work. They're so preoccupied with things that will make them even richer. Why you are busy hating on them? You're putting all your energy on them, your negative energy on them, which is going to cripple you from becoming anyone, anybody. And also, hating doesn't always, it's not always geared to the rich people. Hating can be geared to someone uh, who is on the internet doing something you don't like. Uh, you know, it's something, something. It doesn't get from the internet. It can be a relative of yours. Uh, they bought a house or they've done something amazing. Instead of you appreciating and sharing their joy, you see, then hate on them. You try to find faults in what they have done. But you know that whatever they have done has taken them one notch closer to becoming super successful and having a great life. And you are down here. Your energy, your negativity is keeping you so low because you cannot think beyond that. And remember, your time is not your currency. Your time is, is expensive than your currency. There isn't any amount of money that can pay you a time wasted. So if you're wasting your time on menial things, to, well, yeah, menial stuff. I don't want to say stupid, but stupid, okay? Stuff. You can never gain that time back. Not only that time, but you've created negative energy around you. Your aura is not inviting, buddy. You look ridiculous wherever you are. People can sense it. Oof, that energy, oh my God. Because once you open your mouth and start talking to others, nothing comes out of your mouth but negativity. And people can pick up on that and say, mm, this, this person is so negative. Because believe me, when you talk about ill of anyone else to somebody, they know what they're thinking. Ah, oh, what he says behind my back. They don't trust you. You're not trustworthy unless they're a gossip. Even the biggest gossip in town is mindful of a negative person. No kidding. So beware. Okay? Don't hit on people who are doing better than you. Try to study them, defend them, and learn from them. Believe me. Put in the work. Bye, guys.